We have managed to fight the gremlins. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Seems like sometimes the gremlins get us where we least expect them, but we have managed to find him again. And he's just, again, uh, in a bit of a dip over here, and he seems to be eating some grass, which is quite a rare thing that cats do, and sometimes they do it just to purge themselves, to clean their stomachs. And it seemed earlier that he was also smelling something, but unfortunately for where we st from where we stand, it's it's a bit hard to be able to, to see it. So we're gonna be patient here and just see where he decides to go next. We are <laughs> in a very big block and lots of Lots of going up. I thought there was another lion roaring there. Sorry, but I, it was not. But I mean, just imagine how hard it would be to normally see him. I think we've been super lucky with this guy this morning. It's been incredible. I think he's been moving for quite a lot. KD, you say that Mfumo's face looks the best it has in a long time. Well, that's good news. He's also looking quite healthy in general. He looks very strong, somewhat of a full belly. So I don't think, I don't think he's been struggling lately. I think he's been doing just fine. And I wonder, Taylor and I were talking about it the other day, when we had them roaring right outside our staff village or staff compound or where we stay. They, we heard two, what sounded like two males fighting. So we wonder if up to an extent it wasn't actually, they caught something small like an impala and then they were fighting for it. Whoop. Oh my goodness, how are we gonna get there? Alright, wanna see where you go. He, if he carries on in this direction where he is, we might be able to get him on another road. But I think we're going to have to do a bit of uh, off-roading as well, just to try and keep up with him. And, and see where he goes. I, I see he's busy marking. And let me just move, because then otherwise these guys won't be able to move. Okay, well I can see him. 